Good morning and welcome to Road to Scratch. This is day four. Um, so this is only the fourth day I've gotten to practice uh, since I started this about two weeks ago. Uh, I have gotten the one round in at Olivas. Um, and based on that round, once again, short game is what killed me the most. It's like 6.4 strokes per round or something like that. Horrible. So, um, back out here at Encino and I'm going to do a little short game today or more short game and then more short game and then more short game until I start to actually gain strokes from short game. So I told you on the last video that I was off the mat working on technique. Well, um, I'm going to show you what the grass looks like around the short game area and why I was mostly on the mats. So As you can see, not the best conditions. Um, <laughs> patches of dirt and uh, just a weird crabgrass type of thing. So it's just not the best surface to be practicing off of, but that's what I have. So until I find another better place to practice, that's what I'm going to practice on. So let's get started. So from what I can tell in other videos and vlogs on the other channel, um, I tend to get the shaft too steep and dig the leading edge in or yank my hands trying to put my, too much into it. So a uh, big thing I'm going to work on today is trying to keep uh, a stable plane and try and get under the ball, use the balance instead of digging in. So good luck to me. Never checked it before. This close pin is 18 yards and the further pin is 27 yards today. So nice little short pitches. Should be easy. I don't think I've had three in a row that good ever. Whoops. You got a chunk and a thin back to back. Two shots you don't want to hit. <laughs> ah, there, see there's that big chunk. Now I can watch on video and see why I actually do it. I think I fall back, but we'll find out later. Again, I felt to me, even watch the video, but it felt to me like I just yanked the handle. Happened to hit a good strike, but the technique is horrible. It's basically luck. <laughs> I had 10 of those shots and I'm only executing four. That's not good. It takes your score from the 90s into the 80s or 80s into the 70s. It's a big deal. It just feels like I'm dipping my right shoulder. Again, it's, I like to blame on the grass, but the conditions are not great. Should be able to chip anywhere if you're any good. And that is not the case here. And then you hit a good one. <laughs> Everything feels good. <laughs> oh, what a stupid game. <laughs> I 
think I can get RMZ on the golf course too. And that may be why it gets steep because I don't rotate. So basically just comes up and then straight down to the leading edge of the club. So I'm just going to get a little body rotation. It may help me keep the club on plane. <laughs> or you hit behind the ball four inches. last one's a good one thankfully you can walk away and feel like you did something good maybe so that's it for day four um, as you can see clear indicators of why my <laughs> I lose anywhere from three to seven shots a round on short game just wildly inconsistent uh, frustratingly inconsistent um, so, you know, uh, got another sneak in before work today, a little pre-dawn session, and uh, hopefully it works and it helps, and um, I guess we'll find out during the next round, but uh, try and get another session in here, maybe in a couple of days, and then maybe another round of golf next week to test it. So, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell notification to see the next uh, perfectly inconsistent session. So thanks for watching. See you soon.